steaming cauldrons full of freshly cooked food, the sort of aid desperately needed by Pakistan's flood victims. It's been prepared by an efficiently run and popular organization that has stepped into the vacuum left by the government. But Jamat Uddawa is also banned by the government. You won't see the government doing anything. All the welfare charities and NGOs, they're doing something practical. Whether they give food, water or medicine, they're doing whatever they can. In reality, these welfare charities are way ahead of anything the government is doing. At roadside collection points, members of the public hand over money, confident that it'll be used for aid relief. But Jamaat ad Dawa is an Islamic group that has been accused of being a front for lashkar e taiba which carried out the 2008 Mumbai attacks. Jamaat ad Dawa deny this. However, they also promote a strict interpretation of Islam that's completely at odds with the secular government of Pakistan. Collection points have sprouted up across the country. This one's been set up by locals here in Mingora. Jamaat Udawa are doing exactly the same thing, giving aid that should be coming from the government. That's making Jamaat Udawa very popular, and that's got the government worried. The United Nations says six million people are now dependent on food aid in Pakistan. Those people are going to be grateful to whoever fills their stomachs. They're really taking good care of us. They're bringing food, they're really working hard, and the government haven't done anything. They are here and they are just giving and giving, whether it's raining or not. May Allah bring them even more success. The United States also knows the value of good PR. Its Chinook helicopters have been used to help deliver aid to areas once under Taliban control. Despite that, the U.S. just isn't as visible on the ground as Jamaat ad Dawa and a handful of other local Islamic charities. And being on the ground makes you more likely to win new friends. Bernard Smith, Al Jazeera, Mingora, Northern Pakistan.